where rice smugglers are facing major setbacks following the successful seizure of thousands of bags of foreign parboiled rice along Nigeria's border with the Republic of Bede. Operatives of the Federal Operations Unit Zone A of the Nigeria Customs Service transported 3,235 bags of seized rice loaded onto uh, 10 trucks and other vehicles to the command headquarters in Lagos. What TV News Senior Business Correspondent Ifanaya Eze reports. Thousands of bags of smuggled foreign parboiled rice, each weighing 50 kilograms, we are moved from Abel Kucha to the Customs Federal Operations Unit, Zone A in Lagos. The monumental seizure represents a significant blow to smugglers. Comptroller Kola Oladeji, who led the operation, detailed how officers successfully intercepted the rise from various creeks and border areas. It's based on credible intelligence we got that some people are moving that the, 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 they were trying to move thousands of bags of rice into the country, smuggling. So based on that credible intelligence provided by source, I called my aides and we strategized and I personally led the team. As you can see the quantum of these uh, seizures, they are from various entry points from Republic of Benin into the country. He emphasized that customs officers remain vigilant to counter smuggling activities, especially as the holiday season approaches. He warned smugglers to abandon their illegal practices or face continued losses. We decided to commence an operation we call Swift Sting. That's the code name. And that's what we have started with this. We are not relying on our efforts. We are going to see more by God's grace. The point is, they just have to stop. If they don't stop, we will not stop too until you know we bring them their, bring them down on their knees. Comptroller Oladeji confirmed that no lives were lost during the operation. Ifunanya Eze, TVC News, Lagos.